I think everyone needs to lean towards having a more selfish, self-centered mentality. People need to focus on what's going on in their lives, in their perimeter, before they focus on what's going on in the outside world, in another country. Doing a live stream yesterday, and as you lot know, the US, they got a new president now. A man's asked me my opinion on it. I don't care about what's going on in another country with regards to what president's being elected. Furthermore, in this country, I do not give a fuck who our prime minister is. To the point where I didn't even know Boris Johnson was the prime minister of the UK for about two or three months after he was elected. Me personally, I don't let whoever's the prime minister of this country or the president of the US affect my life. I don't vote. I, I don't care about politics because I know these people cannot do nothing for me. Yeah, sure, they can give you little advantages here and there, but in the grand scheme of things, they can't do nothing for you. The only time you should be worried about who's being nominated to run the country is if you're an ethnic minority and they're talking about social cleansing and sending everyone back home. Yeah, that's when you should be worried. Yeah, sure, it will help a little bit. Oh, if Boris, when Boris Johnson was uh, elected, oh, he's going to abolish stamp duty. Or it might hurt a little bit if he was going to raise the price of stamp duty. In the grand scheme of things, it don't flip him out. It don't matter. It's not, these people that are in power, they cannot help you. They cannot hinder you neither. They might make things a little bit more challenging. They might make things a little bit more easy. But in the grand scheme of things, it's not going to do nothing. Now, don't get it twisted. Some people generally find politics interesting. So that's cool. If they want to talk about what's going on in the US, with regards to who's been nominated or whatever, that's cool. I have a problem with people actually getting emotional about it. You're in the UK. Why are you getting emotional about who is being nominated in a different country? What's wrong with you? Seriously, you're from the UK. You are a British citizen. Some of, people, some of you people haven't even been to America. And it actually gets you emotional with regards to who's been nominated in America. How is what's going on in America affecting you? Just like when I made that video about London Evening Standard looking into the death, the possible death of a president in North Korea. What the fuck has that got to do with the UK? Why do I care what happens to a president in a different country? What has that got to do with me? Is that putting any money in my pocket? Is that helping me succeed? Can I apply for a mortgage with this newfound knowledge? No. People are really are lost in the matrix. I'm telling you, lost in the matrix. If you struggle to find your, your path in life, you're struggling to make something of your life, I'm telling you, it's probably because your, your focus is in, in the wrong place. You don't have to be a complete narcissist and selfish idiot where you step over dead people and you don't give a shit about anyone else. But you need to start leaning towards having a more self-centered mentality. Focus on yourself. Instead of what's going on outside. Don't get it twisted. If, because we know like certain corrupt countries around the world where presidents are lining up or, or were lining up people and killing people, shooting people, Dead. That's different. Yeah, I mean, you lot are human beings and that. So I get that that could get you emotional or whatever. Although it has got nothing to do with you. You have no relations, no ties, no ancestry, nothing to do with you in that country at all. But you heard that back a couple of years ago, whatever, the president's uh, lining people up and shooting people dead in the head. That gets you emotional. I get it. Human beings and stuff, it's, it's normal when you hear things like that. But these presidents in America... Maybe, quote-unquote, they're a little bit racist or whatever. But they ain't killing nobody. They ain't killing nobody. You shouldn't al allow what's going on in another country to affect you. 
That's that's that don't even make no sense. How can something that's going on in another country affect you? If you didn't have access to that news, you wouldn't know about it. So therefore, it don't affect you. Worried about what's going on in another country. Focus on your damn self. This is the problem with most people, irrespective of the colour of their skin. They focus. There's people out here. They got problems within themselves. They're not right within themselves. But what they do is they go around and try and fix other people instead of fixing the, 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 the priority, which is themselves. This is why the black community is in the place that they're in. They're going around trying to fix other black people and fix everything else apart. From, if everyone just looked in the mirror and decided, you know what? Forget everyone else for a moment. Let me fix myself. Problem solved. Problem solved within the black community. If everyone just thought, you know what? Forget about everyone else for a little while. Let me fix myself first. If everyone done that, 90% of people will be fixed. Some people cannot fix themselves themselves. I give you that. But 95% of people, 90% of people, they can fix themselves. If everyone looked in the mirror and said to themselves, you know what? I'm going to fix myself first. 90% of the population will be all right. Then that 90% could go and help and fix that 10% that can't help themselves. But they don't. You know why? Because it's easier to try and fix other people's problems instead of focusing on yourself. I think I've got time to even, again, you know, if you're interested in politics, that's cool. But what's going on in another country should not get to you emotional. No. You're a UK citizen. You've never even been to America. You have no family and friends there, whatever. And even if you do, forget about them for a minute. If they don't like the country that they're living in, they need to do something about it and leave. You're a UK citizen, you've got no ties to America. Why are you interested? Why does it draw emotion out of you what is going on in America? It just don't make no sense to me. People in the UK are happy that a man is no longer the president of... That's, that's crazy. That's crazy. That don't even make no sense. Focus on yourself. You got problems in your life? You want, you, want, you want to help your community? Start by helping yourself. As I always say, our worst enemy is ourself. Look in the mirror and try and fix that person before you fix other things. Stay wise.